I am with the man of the hour, Mr. Pioneer of 90s and 2000s music, um, Mr. Rodney Jerkins. And I want to know, how does it feel to be celebrated tonight by your peers? Man, I'm so humble right now. Um, you know, when, when you're creating music, you're not thinking about the accolades, the praises, and all that. All you're thinking about is that next artist and how you can help make their career flourish and make it better. And all those artists that give me opportunity to co-assist them in reaching their goals, that's that's really, it, it, it really, they deserve it. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm getting an award, but it's because of them. Absolutely. And, you know, when you're thinking about, you know, getting your start in this business, you know, more than t almost 20 years ago, um, you know, what, what comes to mind first? I think, you know, it, it, it goes beyond what people see the after results. For me, it's when I was a kid. It's, you know, it's, it, it's when I was sitting down and I was hitting on a, on a table in school mm -hmm. and, hitting, and hitting the tables and making beats. It started with that. Absolutely. And how can I trans, translate that to success Absolutely. one day? And then it starts to happen. You start to when you're talking about definitive sound, I'm talking about Brandy. I'm talking about Danny DeCane. I'm talking about so many great, great artists. You know, what are, what's, what's next for you? I think what's next for me is, um, well, I've been in the studio with the artist Her, and um, she's amazing. I've known her since she was 10 years old, and we, we've been working recently together, and it's been a really good thing. Um, also, just did something with Ty Dolla Sign. So I'm always looking, you know, uh, what's next, and who's the next artist that I can lend my creative to. And also, my daughter, Heavenly Joy, right here, who's Heavenly with me. Joy. She's amazing. She, her Say voice is... Hey, what's up? <laughs> she's the next generation. You know, so I will continue to, to give what I give to so many others to her. And my last question, since you're in Atlanta, and Atlanta is the host of this year's Super Bowl, I want to know if you have any Super Bowl rituals. How do you prepare for the big game? Listen, I'm a little upset because my team, I'm from, I'm from New Jersey, and Jersey's close to Philadelphia, and the Eagles are my squad. Hey, and in the so I'm a, I'm a little hurt. But I will say that it's some that, that the last teams preparing that, that are coming, it's amazing. It's funny because usually we, we have the Super Bowl Sunday with friends. Um, one of our friends actually is, used to play for the Steelers. So we usually spend it, the Super Bowl at his house. So hopefully I'll be able to get back to L.A. in time to, to spend it there. But the Steelers ain't in it, so we'll see what happens. Cool, man. It's, it's an honor to interview you tonight, and congratulations. Thank you, Thank you so much. Much success to you. Thank you you have an incredible start. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much.